In this video, I'm going to teach you how to connect Samsung tablet to iPhone. It's a very easy process, so make sure to follow along. In this video, I'm going to be talking about the various different options that you have to connect your iPhone and your Samsung tablet, regardless of the model. Something that I need to make very clear is that you cannot just directly connect both of these devices. Apple devices are not meant to be connected with Samsung devices. So while there are still ways that you can get this connection done, usually it is going to depend on the reason on why you want to connect them together. So first, I'm going to talk, I'm going to be talking about the option of transferring your data from iOS to Android or vice versa. So from Android to iOS. This is going to be useful if you want to transfer the data that is on your tablet to the iPhone or the opposite, where you have data on your iPhone that you would like to connect and then transfer to the Samsung tablet. Both iOS and Android have specifically designed applications to help you do this migration or transfer process. On iOS, it is going to appear when you first set up the iPhone. So from the Hello screen, you will find the option to move from Android and then you can choose transfer your apps and data from Android, as you can see over here. This screen will appear during setup for the first time. If you have already gone through this screen, you will need to go into the settings and erase all content and settings and then go through the Hello setup once more. For Android, so on your Samsung tablet, you have the Smart Switch application. This is available on the Samsung Store, and by downloading this application, you will be able to transfer your content from an old iPhone or iPad. So you choose this, and they are going to offer the option to use a cable, which is better, so I would highly recommend using a Lightning to USB cable, or you can try to do it wirelessly, and then the app will automatically transfer over all of the data that you select, such as content, contacts, other pictures, videos, documents, and so on. But like I said, besides these options of transferring your data using these official apps, it is going to be impossible to connect them directly in any other way. So you have to use the spe specialized applications to get this done. Transferring files and other stuff might be more difficult, so it is highly recommended that you use a cloud storage service or an email or messaging app to get that done. I hope I was able to help you on how to connect Samsung tablet to iPhone. If this video helped you, please be sure to leave a like and subscribe for more very easy tips. Thank you for watching.